Hi friends, now we are going to discuss about the frequency translation using PLL or phase lock loop. This is the block diagram for frequency translation using phase lock loop. The block inside the this dashed dashed line is the phase lock loop. Here in this diagram, in addition to phase lock loop, we have added a low pass filter and a multiplier to the phase comparator before phase comparator and also the output of VCO is given to the multiplier or phase comparator here first the input frequency FS is given to the multiplier the FS is the frequency which we have to translate that is the frequency that we have to change is the input frequency that we have to give in to the multiplier the multi the another input of multiplier is the vc output that does the multi the multiplier or phase comparator produce produce output in the in output there are two components that is f f f not plus or minus fs that is fs plus f f f not plus fs and f not minus fs there will be two components in the output one component is f0 plus fs and another is f0 minus fs the low pass filter only pass f0 minus fs the low pass filter reject f0 plus fs that f0 minus fs is given to the phase comparator the another input the phase comparator is the offset frequency or, or f1 this, this is the frequency that we have to how we have to give the here offset frequency how much amount we have to change the in from input frequency with that we have to give it the as of the frequency that is here we have changed the f s plus f naught this f the, the amount of frequency we have to change from f s is have we have to given to the phase comparator then the 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 phase after that the phase lock loop cycle starts that is that is uh, after the lock has occurred the f0 minus fs will be equal to f1 that is f0 minus fs will be equal to f1 then f0 is equal to fs plus f f1 that is f0 is the uh, the output frequency of phase lock loop sorry out, output frequency of voltage control oscillator then we can take f0 and f0 is equal to fs fs plus f1 fs is the input frequency thus thus we can take the output here the output will be equal to f0 is equal to fs plus f1 thus the input frequency fs is translated translated to fs plus f1 this is how frequency translation is done using pll